guys, I literally just got to my hotel room and it's so cute. I love the way the Gymshark just decks everything out. It was quite the travel day today. It wasn't bad. We got here, there's still sunlight. I'm feeling good. I definitely slept on the flight, which was much needed for me. And I was so excited to be able to sit with Christian and Cranon because we we're all on the same flight. So we arranged to just sit in one row together. Thank goodness the Delta people allowed that. But we're here now, I'm in my room. I'm gonna do a little relaxation, but first I wanna show you guys around my room. And also, welcome to the Lyft LA vlog. What in the world? Okay, I don't even know if I've introduced it yet. Currently in LA, I will be here for five days because we have the Lyft LA event this weekend on Saturday and Sunday. A little bit of team activities surrounding those days. And then I also am shooting with Gymshark on Monday and I leave to go home on Tuesday. So I'm gonna take you guys with me the whole week and we're gonna vibe out. But let me show you everything that was in my room when I got here, okay? Stop it, stop it. If you guys saw my Manchester vlog, you know that we got these beautiful little customized athlete goodies. So instead of a hoodie like it was last time, this one is actually just a zip up, which I love. And then we have a matching athlete t-shirt. My name's on there, so cute. This has me geeked out because there's this little Libby on here. And this is just one of the Gymshark fanny packs. Love it. I'm gonna add this to my keychain for sure. These are some of the sweat shorts that Gymshark has that will be matching the joggers up here. The lovely Gymshark socks. These are some of my absolute favorites. And we have the pastels and cute colors here the itinerary for everything and a little note from the team here apparently breakfast vouchers so fun and then look at this this is like a gymshark camera i don't even know but it's like this create a camera thing i've seen this on tiktok like one time before i thought it was so cool there's the batteries for that guy david's collection launches tomorrow if i'm not mistaken so he from his line you can see the little logo of his there which is really cool so shout out to david this brand has some of my favorite sunglasses over here we have hey harper cutie patootie a herringbone chain which y'all know I wore mine for the absolute longest time and then I got all my little snackies and goodies I did specifically ask for boom chicka pop some liquid death which is some good little water I made and we have cosmic stardust and some poppy drinks yay some more little snackies liquid IV some smart sweets all the good things so I'm very excited we also have a $50 DoorDash card and this looks like it's a new little lanyard for my phone which Love her. David's Euphoria pre-workout. You guys, I commented on the Gymshark account when they posted that they were doing the Stanley collab. I said, there better be a little Stanley in our rooms. And I just knew it. I knew it would be here and I'm obsessed. I actually bought a Simple Modern this morning at Target. So I'm excited to have a Stanley. I just knew in my heart I shouldn't bring the Simple Modern because there would be a Stanley here. So I don't know if I manifested it or if I'm just that intuitive. There's also a little bucket hat here. My travel day did not come without a few bumps in the road. Um. My suitcase didn't get lost, didn't just get scratched. She's absolutely beaten, broken down. Please, the poor bays, you guys, what? It has to be a joke. Like, what did Delta do to manhandle and mangle this poor thing? So, I'm not really dwelling on that. It's fine. I'm going to get showered, wash off this travel day, and either get some food with the girlies or go to this cooking class that Gymshark has set up. We're gonna play it by ear a little bit. So, we're in LA. Welcome to the Lift LA vlog. I'm so excited to be here. I can't wait to squeeze you guys. I think I have five four or five different things that I'm doing this weekend. So I gotta get my energy up, live life to the fullest, you know? So welcome to the vlog. The party does not end there. I forgot to show you the bathroom. So the Necessaire body wash, absolutely love. I have this at home. Great stuff, great stuff. And we also have Sol de Janeiro, which I literally packed this, not only the spray, but also the cream here. So I'm excited to try this body wash as well. And then we have Milk Makeup. This is their primer. Okay, slay. And then look at this cutie towel, if you guys remember in Manchester we also got towels from Gymshark. I love this because it's the Gymshark Beach Club and we're also staying at the marina on the little waterfront over here. We turn here and this is my little closet. Of course they decked me out with my Adapt Fleck which I'm obsessed with. Got the shorts, got the bras, all the colors. I brought my own too. Some long sleeves and some goodies here. Brand new Legacy here. So this is a new silhouette of the bra which is gorgeous. And I have new Legacy shorts here which I love. Some everyday seamless leggings in navy. Thankfully I got these here because I did not have them at home and then gym shark crocs with a little shark gibbet. I'm like not okay. It's so freaking cute. That actually concludes the room tour. Oh, I'm showered. I need to find my brush. I don't know where that even is, but we were going to have like some team event where we were going to cook and then there was going to be a chef that made food for us and it was going to be like a little competition or something like that. Instead, me and a few other of the girlies that are already here are going to go get some dinner together at Paloma, but they had these little robes available for us. I thought they were so cute. I have such a beautiful view, you guys. Let me show you. Let's just walk outside. Thank you. 
I'm literally right here on the water, which I think all of us are in some way, but look, we have the most gorgeous sunset right now. I went over to court's room, you guys, and I'm screaming. And she's like, I thought somebody needed to like control their dog or something. Turns out it was a sea lion just hanging out on one of the docks and it was barking. I said, that's amazing. How did he even get up there? He must have just waddled his body there. I don't know. Also going to be on a mission on this trip to figure out how I can replace my bae's bag before I leave and go back home because she's just not doing well. She's not doing okay. I'm so stressed about it, but it's okay. We're just gonna, we're gonna let it happen. Good morning, you guys. I just got up. As you can see, this is my morning voice. Today, we have a busy day. I got up at 6.30, and we are going to, one, get breakfast in the hotel, two, head to John Reed to work out as, like, a team, and we're gonna do, like, team events and whatnot, and three, we're gonna go tour the venue today. So, hopefully the venue is completely done. I am gonna hop in the shower. Good morning. It's our day one, like, full day one. So, like, I'm gonna try to get energized. I need food in my stomach because my stomach is touching my back right now. Literally throwing gang signs to my back. So we've gotta feed Libby. Sunscreen. I have stocked up on these and this is my third tube of the Beauty of Joseon SPF. I'm really gonna have a task today of vlogging on my phone and then also vlogging on my camera. For outfits today, we do have a new outfit that we're wearing and it's going to be the Legacy Collection. They have new colors, so I'm definitely interested to see how this goes. The glow is crazy and I'm still gonna do my bronzing drops. Lashes are done. I think that they're slay. Might add a little bit more blush. I just need to do my hair now. Slick moment into a messy bun, kind of like how I woke up. My hair is done, my face is done, and now I'm picking out my outfit. Let me show you guys what I've got. Okay, so we do have to wear Legacy today, and I have both these plum and these brown ones. I also got this pinkish bra. I thought that these would look like great together, and to be honest, the logo on the back of these does match, but I feel like from the front, it just is too different. You know what I'm saying? So I think that I'm just gonna wear a white bra, and I was debating between the brown or the plum. I think I'm gonna do the plum. But look at this new legacy bra. Like this is the fit. So cute. Mesh, little cleavage moment. The legacy right there. Look at the back of it. Like I feel like I could flex right now. The back of it has this adjustable strap, which is so dainty and darling. And then I'm wearing my plum legacy shorts, tootie patootie, and I have these sweats on because I'm chronically cold since moving to Houston. I New Balance 9060s. Slay. We're gonna go down to breakfast. I feel like I'm already late. Hey, it's beautiful out here. Like the lighting. So oh, nice. what did you decide on today? Thumbnail. Chicken and French toast. Why the eggs are so orange? Is that because they're good? Amazing. Apparently, I got the wrong one the first time. No, that's okay. I thought it was mine. Truly. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Bus driver, move that bus. Guys, want to hear a funny story about me and Libby? We've been besties for like two, three years. No, it's been like yeah. And this is like the second or third time we've met. We've only seen each other maybe twice. But that's how the best friendships are cultivated. Now we're headed to John Reed. What's up, guys? So what's up? What's up? Out here at John Reed. I'm just what gonna, are you gonna do? I'm just gonna sit in the corner and cry. But I'll yeah. actually join you for that. This Super is a cool tour. John Reed because I actually hate the LA one so much. The downtown LA came with me. Yeah. Hi. I'm just gonna keep it like that. You guys were 20. Are we? <laughs>
just finished the little athlete day. It was so fun. I think I liked this even more than Manchester and maybe it's because we had like more people. I'm not really sure. Both were amazing. This time was my favorite. I was team captain. I don't know how I got nominated because I wanted Noah Olsen to be team captain. Libby somehow became captain and all the little activities that we did were so freaking fun, you guys. It was just like such a good little bonding experience and I just love hanging out with gym track athletes and just hanging out with everybody, bonding with them, sharing time together. The vibes were so good. It was just so fun. Like the energy was high. We ended up coming back to the room though because we're just like getting a little bit more social battery, I think. And then we're going to head out and get a little tour of the venue in just a little bit. But I've just been in my room. I just edited a TikTok. I am just like low-key stoked and also a little bit terrified of how this weekend's gonna go because I think it's gonna be so amazing and so fun, but it's just gonna be a lot. So I'm just trying to mentally prepare myself, y'all. I don't even know what was filmed. I gave my camera to Peyton and I hope that she filmed everything. I'm sure I'll see that when I look back at this footage. But I just have to pop in here and say that I had such a good time today. I loved being competitive I'm such a competitive person if you guys didn't even know not even fully into day one yet and just feeling good Just feeling amazing very grateful very thankful and blessed to even be here and to Experience this with so many cool people meeting more people of the team more athletes it's just, it gives me chills. I literally have chills right now because I'm just so happy to be here. I say this in every single video where I do anything with Gymshark, but I just wouldn't be here without you guys. And I know that's so sappy and disgusting and gross. And you know, I hate showing my emotions like that, but I, I just feel very lucky for the opportunity to be here in such a beautiful place. Like I'm just looking at the water and I can't believe that. I just get to be here and to soak all of this up. I think a lot of times we just question, are we doing the right thing in life? Like, should I change my trajectory? Should I pursue something else? And anytime I'm in this position where I'm just sitting in my room reflecting, I get really grossly emotional and it's just like you don't want the moments to end at all It's it just feels so nice to be here to be with people that get you and connect with you and I'm just so happy I'll check back in once we get ready to head to the venue Hopefully it's done because I know in Manchester the day before it was like a little bit undone. We're gonna hope for the best today Take a sip of your coke tell me to pause I ain't gonna buy the pros, I came to talk It's no mimosas, cheese, cracks, and parks Dig it to the hit on the bottom, the blue cars You been sniffing mirrors and toilets all over town I made excuses for you too many times You know I love you forever, but that's beside the point I'm sick of watching you crash like you're a Bitcoin Marissa is doing a science experiment for me We're literally about to leave for dinner We have like two minutes to get to dinner, but we have better but, things to do Yeah, we have these cute little cameras that Gymshark got for us And they're digital somehow you need to unscrew this yeah like it's literally like you got the sd card and everything yeah that's the sd it's already oh. in there. hold and like when those two lights turn blue that's when you lift up so like press the little button this? yeah press <gasps> the way that your um, eye is looking at this is let me show you what your eye you looks can like see You know what I mean? I'm about to get ready. Um, I have coffee getting delivered in just a second. I'm so excited. I've seen messages from you guys already and you're like, see you this morning. I'm so happy when we toured the event space yesterday. My jaw dropped and my heart fell to my booty. It just looks so amazing. And I feel like it's gonna be so fun to just hang out with everybody. And the pink wall guys, by the athlete wall, I was Shooky cookie how large those like wall covering things were I just have very high hopes today today is not an extremely busy day for me today I have my meet and greet and then I have my little panel chat with wit our little gym girl chat Which I think is gonna be really really fun. So I'm looking forward to it successfully got our coffee drop-offs I get a grande light iced oat milk latte with brown sugar syrup and caramel drizzle I know it's a lot and it's not even really coffee at this point, but it's so good. It's such a treat I haven't had coffee from Starbucks in so long and I only do at events because I always make my coffee at home now. 
That'll do. That'll do. For what eye drops? Lumify. Make your eyes literally white. Have you not seen them? I'll show you. Okay, look at my eyes now. Okay. Your eyes aren't even red. I know, but it's gonna almost turn blue. Mm. What? It literally like whitens the whites of your eyes. <laughs> You're recording Guys, me. Guys, I'm, <laughs> I'm having a breakdown because my braid is not looking good. And we have an hour before we need to leave, which is That's fine. I can get out. it done, but... Okay, look. Look at the difference in my eyes. What? Isn't that so crazy? It's blue. It's literally blue. And like... Okay, it's... I want one. Yeah. Wait, Go ahead. Good. Lumify eye drops. I know it doesn't look crazy, but you can see that this eye is literally like piercing white compared to this one, which looks normal and natural, okay? Crazy. All this time... I've been feeling hopeless till you came around, came around All this time, you're the only reason I'm not chasing highs, chasing highs What is love? Lately I've been wondering just what is love, what is love I don't know, no one ever showed me I've been on my own I just really need food, that's all. I got bracelets. One says alive, one says speak now. And this one says Alani new. I'm collecting. I'm gonna go do our panel in a little bit and Brittany's hosting us, so I'm super excited for that. But right now, I need to eat a little something. You got the face tune thing on here. Got face tune? Yeah. Oh, cause it like blurs your skin. You want me to take it off? Hello, Libby's people. Libby and I are hanging out. We're having the grandest time. A long 12 hour day. Goodness gracious. I can't find my room. I'm just gonna ask the afternoon. Good morning, you guys. I know my hair looks crazy, but I have a method to my madness. Okay, yesterday, I wish that I was able to vlog more in the morning, but I had an issue, and it was my hair, and I just feel most confident in photo shoots, events, all of that when my hair is in my Dutch braids. As you guys know, something about it, I don't know if it's the water here, like I don't know if it's hard water making my hair feel weird. I'm giving every excuse I can because I hopped in the shower multiple times trying to redo my hair. I dried it, I'm like, maybe I can do it dry. I tried everything and it just wasn't working for me, which is fine. Ended up just going with like a slick back braid. And then when I got there, Morgan just braided my hair and did a French braid on it. And I was like, okay, it's fine, whatever. Now today, I feel like day one, I felt really confident because my hair was like slick back, like I like, but the bun was big. So I have put like a little bit of product in the bottom of my hair just because if I don't, then it gets too airy and there's not curls like 
defined in the bun. Do you know what I mean? Curly girls know. So I've already started to slick down the front here, which is why it looks a little crazy. Now for outfits today, I gave Rain in my everyday seamless shorts yesterday because she was in leggings. I was like, it's too hot for that. Wear these. I think I'm gonna wear the halter bra possibly with these flex shorts. Today I have my panel talk first and then I have my meet and greet and then I have my class with court, which we're doing posterior pump. Basically just doing the whole posterior chain, just hitting a little bit of everything there. So I'm sorry I didn't vlog yesterday. I just wasn't in the headspace, okay? Today, I'm feeling a lot better. Marissa's gonna come down in a little bit. I know my eyes look so white. It's these Illumify eye drops. Chris just came down and used mine, and she's actually the reason I got put onto these at the last event I saw her at. I do have, I think Nick is going to vlog and get B-roll for me today because I don't even know what who vlogged or anything yesterday. I was just taken all day by you guys and honestly i just want everybody at home to be able to experience the moments and everything with us hopefully nick has some good footage that i can insert but yesterday i'm so sorry it was the greatest day ever though i had such an amazing time and i'm so thankful that so many of you guys came out i was just meeting you all day long had an amazing time on the panel chat with brit and wit literally loved it so much i love that brit hosted us yeah i just had my meet and greet and we walked around i got to see everything today is a little bit more busy but i'm gonna bring you guys with me update slay Crane literally like two doors down from me she was like oh yeah. i brought mine i just didn't bring them to the event i'm now wearing them i don't think i've tried on the everyday seamless shorts thankfully she cut the tag out of these okay they're cute i'll show you guys my outfit once i put my halter bra on look at it it's so cute and from the side it looks really turn to the side other side and that side like it's really good how like the little hair is uh yeah, it yes really good. this is this is what we you want ladies okay guys the hair we got there, no problem. Here's a little fit, let me show you. Hello, this is the Gymshark Halter bra, okay? And then the backy bag. Oh, my spot's still there, yeah. And then the everyday seamless leggings, or shorts. Hi. Yeah. What's the worst case scenario? Plan out in your head how it's all gonna go So you think you got it covered But there's always something new that you discover you've not thought about You can never figure out Every possible outcome and you're so scared you'll get it wrong Have a good time but a worry after Petrified will they think I'm awkward When your brain's wired for disaster Even good things leave a bitter taste Try to calm down, thoughts spinning faster Terrified, hide it with laughter When your brain's wired for disaster Even good things leave a bitter taste Even good things leave a bitter taste, yeah Even good things leave a bitter taste, yeah Even good things leave a bitter taste, yeah Even good things leave a bitter taste Something unexpected happens You can't let it go, caught up in your own distractions You already know that you're gonna think about this for a while why you try not to lose your mind Not to believe the lies that you tell yourself That you tell yourself Have a good time but a worry after Petrified when they think I'm awkward When your brain's wired for disaster Even good things leave a bitter taste Try to calm down, thoughts spin them faster Terrified, hide it with laughter even good things leave a bitter taste. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Yeah. Even good things leave a bitter taste. Worry won't change the outcome. But I've been doing this for so long My brain keeps signaling danger Although I know that I'll be just fine Worry won't change the outcome But I've been doing this for so long My brain keeps signaling danger Although I know that I'll be just fine Even good things be a bit of danger 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 it is the next morning. I have my stuff packed up here. I had to get another suitcase because mine didn't like me. But I'm headed to go shoot with Gymshark right now. So I'm gonna bring you guys with me. Usually I don't post. I don't post. I don't post. Usually I don't post.
else, but I want the world to know. Time to pull the drop tops out. Summer nights, it's a vibe, yeah. We've been keeping it in the house. Netflix and chilling, a GDM in, yeah. Didn't wanna share my love till I found someone I'm sure of. Young and untamed, I've been out of range, keeping it low. But I wanna be bold with it. Don't care who we told about it. Well, baby, gotta hold on it. Don't let love on for tonight. They'll be calling us gold. You know like so fair with it. People let them stare at it. Now I'm prepared. Oh, it's said a love fall out since we ain't going away. So tonight. But I never let him catch me No, I never let him play me Wild thing, try to take me But you got my mood on sunshine Let's take a trip Souls on big smile Let's get this lick Stars are in the night I'm supposed to lay with me in the moonlight I wanna be bold with it Don't care who we told about it Wild baby, gotta hold on it Don't let love unfold tonight They'll be calling us gold no I can finally end my vlog here. I don't really have a voice at all, but that's just what happens at these Gymshark events. I don't even know how to recap this entire weekend. I'm just so grateful, and I know I keep saying it, but I'm so grateful that I get to work with a brand that pours into us just as much as we pour into it. I can't tell you how much it means that Gymshark puts on these events and they care for us to meet you guys, to meet our audience, our communities, the people that support us, the people we inspire, which I still have imposter syndrome, and I'm like, how am I so in inspiring people when you take everything that you do online and you get to see it manifest in person and you get to see the people whose lives you've affected whether it's something big or small it's just the most insane and overwhelmingly rewarding feeling ever i was asked so many times what my favorite part of the weekend was or favorite part of this event i don't think i have a favorite i honestly think that it's just the community whether it's the athletes or being able to meet you guys my cup gets so so full every single time and i always think that it can't be done better or bigger and it always always is without a doubt i've just met so many amazing people and i've been able to connect with so many people my body is telling me like girl you have to chill out it's hard to chill out when your adrenaline just keeps pumping day after day after day after day it's the best ever day one was incredible i can't tell you whether day one or two was better honestly i think they just have to be mashed together in their entirety because not only was the venue incredible but just the energy was amazing i feel like i got to do so many different things i went ahead and did my meet and greet which felt like it was never going to end and i never wanted it to it was just the best feeling ever i got gifts from you guys and it's so cool because i i know who i'm talking to in dms i see your pictures and when you guys remind me of something we've talked about or something that you've said to me everything just floods back in my brain and i know exactly who it is and it feels like there's nobody else in the moment but you and me even though there's so so much chaos and so much hecticness going on around us. Day two, I had my gym girl chats with all the ladies. So I had Deanna, Brittany, Annalise, me, and then Ken and Kat. And that was an awesome time just being able to dive into things that are a bit deeper and things that we, that we don't get to talk as deeply on with social media. It was just nice to have such a cool audience, like over 200 people relating to us and asking amazing questions and just hearing us out. After that, I got to do my meet and greet, which was amazing. And then finally, I wrapped up all of my little sessions with a posterior pump class with Court. And I've never led a workout class before or done anything like that. And I was really, 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 really nervous to do it. Like, I don't have a problem showing up, I don't think, in public 
speaking, but I've just never been put in that position before and I figured out how much I really, really love it. My favorite part was just being able to walk around and help you guys with form and to hype you up and to get you to your PRs and make you feel like you are the strongest woman ever. And it's so cool because it's like when people are standing in front of you working out and working on themselves, you see each individual journey just unraveling and being added to. And it's so fulfilling that I, a regular girl that shares my life online can have such a cool impact on strangers but friends do you know what i mean like once we're together it feels like we've known each other forever so eternally grateful for that after the event wrapped up this morning i headed to the shoot location we were doing some stuff for gymshark and that was the thing that was like all right it's time to rest for the next week but it's just so nice to work with the team not the events team necessarily but with the team that does shoots and produces all of the stuff because i've known a lot of them for years now and since a lot of them are in the uk we rarely get to actually see them so it's just nice to cultivate those friendships and no matter how much time has passed it feels like you haven't taken a break from seeing each other it feels like you just hop right back in and you can pick up wherever I'm decompressing a little bit i haven't had just like a moment of solitude in days now which is totally okay with me but i know that my body needs it so i'm gonna decompress for a little bit and then we have dinner tonight and i head home early 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 tomorrow morning <sighs> i just have to say thank you guys for being here thank you for following my journey and being part of it whether you're somebody that i have met in person that's come to these events you're somebody that i've mentioned that i've been able to comment back to or we've had dm conversation whatever it may be just know that you have not only inspired me but you've been such a large impact in my life and the reason that i love showing up and sharing my life because this is something that might seem so far-fetched and so crazy that only few people can do but if anybody can be the example of like oh you can be a gym short athlete let it be me just to be surrounded by so many amazing people that have different outlooks on wellness and physical health mental health it's so cool but the thing that just brings us together is our love for our communities and our love for conditioning and moving our bodies in a way that feels best to us like powerlifters bodybuilders sprinters crossfit like th the list goes on as to like how people move their bodies and it's just amazing to have all of that in one place and i'm so thankful that you guys showed up i'm so thankful that you're watching this right now that you support me that you support gymshark that we're able to do these events and that i'm invited to these events it still shocks me every time i just want to say thank you so much I love you more than you know and i can't can't wait for the next lift event i can't wait for the next lift event whenever it may be who knows if you enjoyed this video give it a like i'll see you guys soon i promise um you guys can keep up with me every single day on instagram and tiktok at libby christensen i'm gonna rest my voice i love you guys and i will talk to you guys later